Hey guys, for sure straight here in today's video, I'm going to show you how to see the battery level for your Sony wireless headphones on your iPhone. So by default, if you connect your headphones, which is really easy to do, you go simply into your settings and then go to Bluetooth and then make sure your Bluetooth is turned on. So in order to connect here, all I do is turn on the power button where it's also the Bluetooth button on these CH720. So I'll click on hold here and wait for that device to basically pop up here. So you just press and hold the button. And then I'll click on over here and then connect it to my iPhone, right? Once you connect it to it, you can click on the eye icon here, but it doesn't give you the battery information. So how do you get the battery level? Well, it's really simple. In order to get it, there's actually an app for the headphones themselves from Sony, which you can go into the app store and then go to search here and then search for Sony Headphones Connect and it's going to be the very first app Sony Headphone Connect which is going to look like this with right now it has over 35,000 ratings you're going to click on that get option to of course install it so I'm going to go ahead and install it here the installation should be pretty quick make sure you're connected to good strong Wi-Fi or cellular data to download the app like you would with any app here it's saying uh, there's a timer of how long it's going to take but it should be quicker than that now once you um, install the app I'll show you how you can set it up here so here if we can exit out of the app store here we see the app is downloading so we'll give it a moment for the app to download and then I'll show you how we can connect the headphones as well and if you guys are interested in these kind of headphones review I did another one on our channel we'll leave a link for that one for these and the five I believe 10 series as well if you're looking for good wireless headphones which I find these are pretty good for the price range that they are offered at so here we have almost there to get the app installed here All right, so app is installed. We're gonna go ahead and open it up. And once you open it up, you're gonna of course select a region and then agree to their licensing policies. We'll just agree and then we agree and start using. That's not to track. And then if you want notification, you can allow. I usually don't, but you want you only need to enable the Bluetooth so that they can have access to connect. So here. Once you go through that step, it will start looking for the device. So make sure it's close by here. So I'll have the headphones really close by here so then you can detect it. Okay, so it's detected here. So I hit OK here. And then you can sign in if you want more access, but I'm just going to do that later. Now, if you have all, any settings or data from your previous phone, you can restore that. I'm just going to do it without restoring any of that. And then the setup process tells you some of the features on these headphones that there's available. I'm just going to hit next here. As you can see here, there's ambient sound control based on action. I'll just do that later. And then other stuff around that I'll just do later. And then 360 reality audio setup, if you want to do that, we can hit next. I'll just do later because I'm just going to show you how you can see it. So once you're set up, it says setup is complete. You go to dashboard. And right here, if you notice, the battery level on your headphones will show up just here. as you can see here I have 56 percent on these so that's how you determine the battery level of your headphones as you can see here if you go into your settings again I mentioned that once it's connected right it doesn't really give you that information so if you really want to get the battery level each time you just simply open it up once you're connected and it will give you the battery percentage just right here so I hope this video was helpful so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time